Morning guys, welcome to Baguio. This is the greatest road trip. We ready? Are we ready? Iba na sa KM23 na, the first gas station outside of Enlex. And as they all go to Pampanga, kikitain ko sila dito. Andito na kasi ako because I spent Holy Week with my family. And then sabay-sabay na kami pupunta all the way to Baguio. Sa na yun? Ayan, it's Baguio. Ayan. We have a very optimistic goal to be gone by around 2.30 to 3 a.m. Para by the time we get to Baguio, kaya lampas na Marcos Highway, it's gonna be sunrise na and it's gonna be perfect. So the luggage goes in the back. I also have a really big Thor toolkit right here. Let's get our tools natin just in case merong mangyari. Sana naman wala, Lord God, please. Mabilis ang check-up lang. Na-check ko naman ito kanina. I made sure everything's okay. We're gonna be in this car for the next couple of days. First start. So far, so good. Here's the Evo that we're gonna be with for a couple of days, guys. Naka excited, super. I pray, Lord God, na walang mangyari na masama during this travel and you keep us protected throughout this whole adventure of ours. Mao, tanila sabi ko gusto ko rin ng luma. Luma. Timeless na. Ina sila voice. So in si Moses, naka FJ, he finally arrived. And si Enrique, so first time ko makasama yung AW11 niya ng malayo. Si Cal, si Cal, kakabalik lang nito from the States. Ang tagal ko nang hindi nakita tong lalaki na to. Bro, natuloy tayo! RPM ko. Naglolo ko. Nagpa-fluctuate yung RPM ko. Okay lang yan. We'll deal, but, we'll but, deal with it, bro. But it's bro. good. Wala siyang misfire or anything. Wala yeah. Welcome home, pare. I haven't seen you in too long, bro. Thank you. Nice Thanks for you. coming, bro. Thanks for coming. Para sa akin kasi, bro, ang kotse, kahit ganong kaluma pa yan, dapat magamit natin siya. Parang kotse. Yeah. Alam mo yun, true, like, to be true. used the way that it is. I mean, it's iconic, of course, but no use if hindi natin siya magagamit to how we'd want, tama, diba? Tama. We're here at PTT, and we're an hour away. The goal natin is to get to Marcos ng mga 5.30, right? Uh, we're gonna get there in record time, bro. As long as they follow me. Anong mo? Bro, wala nila? Altis, humahataw ba? Oo, kaya ka, kaya ka, eh. Oh, bro, I should've brought my, my car. I should've brought my car, bro. So ito na yung gang natin for tonight guys, Enrique's AW11, the Calvin's Celica 7th Gen, the Evo is here, the FJ Cruiser is right there. Andito yung Altis ni Tonyo, buti nga nakasama siya actually eh. Tapos ayun ulit yung MR2 ni Enrique. Ready? Yeah man. Ready bro? We're good, we're good. We're good, we're good. Ready, Cal? Let's go. Cruise lang, cruise lang. Mamaya pagdating natin sa Baguio, wala na akong maginig. Takbong pamilyado. Ha? Enjoy lang natin. Promise, mapagalan ko lang. Ride safe bro ah. Mapagalan ko lang, mapagalan ko lang. We have to make up time, konting make up time. So konting, just a bit faster than usual. Enzo's kind of a lot to take bro. He's... Bro, ride safe ah. Yeah man, thank you, thank you. Yeah, thank you bro. Good times bro. We ready? Are we ready? Time check, it's 3.47. We're about to go through. Deplex na yata ito eh. So far, everything's been well. The cars are performing good. Naiiwan lang si Tonyo, yung friend namin with the Altis. They're in the back somewhere. So buti na lang, we're sharing locations through Facebook now. We're about to pass through Deplex. Calvin. Si Calvin, guys. Taga Cavite kasi yan eh. I haven't seen him in such a long time. Ngayon ko na siya nakita ulit. And first time ko rin makita yung kotse niya madrive ng ganitong kalayo. Ganyan lang, ganyan lang. Okay na yan.
Match lang, match. So guys, right now we're about to go through T-Plex. Ah, de, ano ba? Dulo na ng T-Plex to, no? Ah, nasa Rosario na pala tayo sa Rotonda. So, it's been a really good drive so far although I do need some fuel. Uh, everything's been well. The time right now is 4:40, so sakto na rin sa packet natin. Kuha na ako ng fuel dito sa may clean fuel. <laughs> dito na tayo sa clean fuel, guys. We're going to make our second stop. Well, actually, technically parang first stop natin 'to eh. And the crew's coming in. And you bantay natin si Moses. <laughs> the boys are all good. All the cars are fine. We will up lang tayo. Ah. Na ubus na tayo ng konte don due to that run, but so far so good naman. Ito si Moses. Uh, he came with his parents, no? So alalay lang din si Moses when he's driving here with us right now. Good. 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 Ayos. Tigil lang kami sa clean fuel bago umakyat. Banyo brake, syempre, saka cool down. Yung, yung kotse, okay na okay. Yung driver, medyo kailangan mag-cool down. <laughs> syempre, paborito ko dyan yung pulang Toyota. <laughs> Ang pakatipid nung dala ko na Celica. After 240 kilometers, one-third pa lang nababawas sa gas ko. Matik pa. May cruise control, so very comfy sa long drive. Hindi lang siya kasing exciting nung iba kong manual na Celica, pero ito ang plane natin na pinapalipad ngayon. So guys, ito yung AW11 Enrique. Such a beautiful vehicle. It's the oldest car that we have here. And ito naman yung FJ Cruiser ni Moses. This is Calvin's 2001 Toyota Celica 7th Gen. They imported this straight from the US. It's all original. Sobrang ganda, grabe. This is actually one of my dream cars when I was younger. I was never able to get it, but I'm glad that someone else in our crew was able to get one. So at least nakikita kita ko pa rin siya. Ang ganda sobra. We're about to go up Marcos Highway. So the time right now is 5 a.m. With how it's going, we'll get there at exactly sunrise. Ito talaga yung mga panaginip namin before. But the sun's starting to come up, guys. Uh, unfortunately, parang ang daming tao ngayon sa Marcos Highway. Hindi namin yung expect to. We're starting to see the mountain, guys. It's so beautiful. Ganda, grabe. Look at that. Alam nyo, if you guys like driving and you've never driven your car far away but you trust it, Baguio's the best place to go. Whether Canon Road or Marcos Highway, whatever it is, it's always going to be worth it. Ang ganda, grabe. <laughs> able to do this with your barcada. Grab it. It's such an accomplishment, guys. Guys, hindi ako makapaniwala. We finally made it to Baguio. Itong nakikita nyo ngayon, ito yung vision namin before and nangyari na nga siya. This is absolutely crazy, guys. Look. Look at that. The Evo and the MR2 all the way in Baguio. Unfortunately, I'm in a slow car. Okay naman, okay naman. I wanna say, ang solid ng MR2 mo, bro. The way that you led everyone there. The car is in its prime state. Ewan ko kung may ilang ka pa sa kotse na to at all. May ilang pa ako. May ilang ka pa sa lagay na to, bro. So far, so good. Engine check muna tayo. Paps, this is my EK, Paps. SIR. Ganda naman ang Civic mo, bro. 
Yes, Paps. Solid, Pops. solid. Salamat, Paps. Pangilang owner na to, Joe. Ayun nga, Paps. Sabihin mo nang nasa 20 na, si- 20 na siguro ako, Paps. <laughs> so, ito si Joe, guys. Ito siya yung binupuntahan natin dito sa Baguio. You guys might know him. Ito bahay niya here. All the cars. Look at that, guys. Crazy. Ito yung SIR niya. Dapat kasabay namin to, eh. Pero nagka-complication kasi siya. Sabay ba tayo ba, ba? Yeah, definitely. Okay, okay. Look at that. So, dreams are made of right here, bro. Tito mo yan. May dilemma kasi to si Joe guys na nakakoil siya, inakit na niya yung height, kaso kahit anong mangyari, ang tagtag pa din talaga. Well, I adjusted the dampening, lahat, the preload and everything, so wala pa rin. But it's, it's beautiful bro. What right. tires do you have? R01 R- ba? R01, yeah. Ang ganda nung checkered flag na ano yun, no? Yeah, yeah bro, actually. Yeah. I, I like flashy looking tires and the sporty look. Also bro, I never knew nung mas bata tayo that the tires would add to the aggressiveness of the car. Yeah, yeah. We're currently shooting Enrique's car here at Green Valley. It's like a hidden hidden place for photo shoots in Baguio. I'm sure mga tao from Baguio alam nila kung saan to. Personally for me, this is really the driving destination. A lot of people in the 70s and 80s and even the 90s they used to drive here to enjoy their cars, no? Back then, puro carburetors pa yung mga auto nila eh. The place now is obviously abandoned. It's not as nice as it was, but there's still some hidden areas right here where you can take photos, so. Oh, Ito, <laughs> hello, hello, hello. Hi, Tita. Nice to see you. Guys, look at that parking lot. Grabe, pogi. What a sight. Sige, sige na natin makakuha ng apat na paa. Sige, sige. Sige, sige. Sige, sige. Sige, sige. Sige, sige. Meron tayong kasama dito. Moses, how's your first bonfire? This is the best bonfire I've ever experienced in my life. Well, what can you say about the difficulty of creating such such beauty? This bonfire is the most amazing bonfire I've ever seen in my whole life. At the age of 27, when I started my first bonfire. Does that make you a lumberjack, Mr. Moses? No, it makes me a bonfire specialist. Amen! Some ASMR stuff for you. So all the car guys out here, meron tayong mga ano accessory lights para pwede ka magwork sa kotse mo kahit anong oras of the day. Lakas ba rin? May tao dyan, may tao dyan. Ang lakas bro. 5,000 lumens. Yung sayo, yung sayo. 1,000 lang ata. Parang yung kay Kalan lakas bro. 1,000 lang. Ito. Ano ba yan? 400. Yeah, 400, 600, Perfect. tapos 1,000 1K? 1K to. Yung akin kita na yung moon dahil tinuto ko yung ilaw ko dun eh. Hindi ako alakas ko. Ang galing, ang galing, ang galing. Narealize ko na ba't gusto mo yung all-wheel drive. <laughs> And to think, Cal, to think, Cal. I would kill for it. To think, hindi ko pa na drive yung manual na all-wheel, bro. Mat- matic pa. Matic all-wheel drive. Matic pa, so it's... You have all the LSDs and stuff here. It's, right a, it's a tiny turbo, bro. Malit eh. Yan lang yun? Malit. I'm surprised, TDO4. man. That's it? Although, Joe, TD04 yung tawag. TD04. TD04, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. TD04. Ito yun yung sa nga. Pajero, bro. Pajero rin, TD. Pajero din, TD04. Yung sa EVO 9, TD05, pare. Laki, kailangan mo palitan yung, yung front mount. How old is that? HKS, oh? No, I don't know. You pero can, the, pero the Radis new. You can barely see the... The Radis new. That, that's pretty cool, man. Yeah, that still works well. HKS. Good morning, guys. Day 3. Hindi ko na kayo masyado na update with what's going on. On the day that we arrived here, we just tried to make the most out of everything. We set up a bonfire. nag kami. So far, we haven't really driven around Baguio just yet. It's been a really, really great time. Look at the place that we're staying at right now, sa Green Valley. Super calm place and quite secluded enough na wala masyado mga turista. So you really feel like you're living like a local. Alam mo yung you'd expect for it to be hot. Kasi ang init-init sa Metro Manila. Dito malamig. Actually, last night, I think we hit 16 degrees. Hello, mga 
record pala. Sir Larry Chen, it's an honor to meet you. Hey, Thank nice you. to meet you. I Thank like you. your car. Guys, so right now, we're using the GoPro and shooting the AW11, the Celica, the Evo, and the SIR. I hope the audio is clear enough, but look at this. This is a sight that we've only dreamed of having. And I don't know if we can do it again, but just look at how beautiful this is. It's very hard to replicate all these cars that originally came from Manila. So hopefully, we'll do it again in the future. But maybe, because I hope there will be more coaches, I hope there will be more together. It will be more of a fun adventure since it's kind of a long trip. But this is basically what we were waiting for it to happen. Five. Four, three, two, one. One more. We're trying to take car photos so that we have something to look back at. Because, of course, we don't know when the next time we're going to do it. So look at how beautiful this shot is. Look at that. Enrique, what you doing, bro? You added oil. Kalo ka iniwan mo ko, bro. So it was Enrique just giving some tender loving care sa AW niya. Tires niya orig rin. Orig. Yung sa akin orig, bro. 2003 yata. Tire date. So hindi kami masadu na kadrive sa Baguio. So hopefully today makakikut ikut kami. So one of the most important things you can do when traveling is to check your coolant level, shampering yung brake fluid mo, power steering fluid, and of course your oil. Ako naman, chinek ko naman to before leaving and I made sure everything was in tip-top shape so I wasn't too worried about the car. Pero syempre, hindi mo alam eh, you know, accidents happen and kaya nga hindi mo sila, hindi mo ini-expect na mangyayari sila, di ba? So for my coolant, I used the Mitsubishi, the official Mitsubishi Motors Philippines radiator coolant. I got this from online. Is it authentic? I'm not sure, pero mukha naman because... I paid pretty good money for this. So, of course, um, if you're more familiar with your older cars, it's also very healthy to check your oil. So, madali lang yan. There is a dipstick right here. It's about three fourths. Mayra pala pag two door, hindi namin magamit yung mga kotse namin. Door no shocks pa rin. Hindi siya nagsisink into one side or the other. Woo! Actually, Carl, we didn't go to like a Maka Judge because you know how it's cool. Guys, so last night na, well, we just wanna build um. Ano? Why? Why? Maybe. May pako, may pako. Siyun yung mahirap yung pako. Work. Nice, nice. Simple act of lighting up this, these logs. Bagay. Parang sawi. Sawi nga. At this point in time, time check. It is. 2.26 So ito si Cal He's taking the initiative na sikipan lahat ng log nuts namin So thank you bro for Welcome For being this this proactive no? Oo bro This is ano This is how the car people give love pare Show love diba? So once again we're preparing to head down back to Manila Time check it is 2.27am Hopefully we get there before daylight Before sunrise siguro Right by sunrise May na-discover kang maluwag bro so far Wala pa naman. Wala pa naman. Good, good, good. <laughs> okay yun bro. Make the most out of things. Si Moses, or yung naka-FJ Cruiser, he already went down today. So ang sasabay sa atin ngayon is my friend Joe. After a very long time, we're gonna be in a convoy. So ito yung SIR niya. You guys have probably seen this. In other videos of mine, yun yung Celica ni Cal. So it's gonna be a 1, 2, 3, 5 car convoy. Back to Manila. I realized ko, I had a flash ako, hindi mo pala kailangan yung flash ko bro. <laughs> Guys, look at this. Ready anytime. It's a robot. So this is ano bro, a kit na nabibili para ready for any type of lug nut. Most Ex lug nuts pasok mo dito sa tatlong. Amazon. Ang galing ah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pasado. 
Kasi sa torque wrench na ng braso ko. <laughs> Calibrated yung braso ko, 90 foot pounds. <laughs> Ito kay Enrique Gusto mo ikaw na? Oo, oh, okay na sa ako na Kaya bro, kalibrate mas ano <laughs> Ano tawag dito sa bird na to bro? Eagle, eagle to diba? Screaming chicken Yes, <laughs> okay, sorry Doesn't sound <laughs> Time check, um, it is 2.58 We are going back down to Manila Estimated time of arrival is 6.57 Maaga na nga yun, coding pa naman yung iba Anyway, of course my passenger princess is Viren the one and only. Oh my god, look at that, bro. You know, back is actually really cold. As in, kung, kung sa Metro Manila, it's 40 degrees. Tito, it's 16 with a really cool breeze. It's it's more than you'll ever need. The whole night, hindi na ako naka jacket because I wanted to soak in how cold it was here because I know I won't get that in Manila. <laughs> Right now, guys, we just passed the T-Plex entrance. So, it's yung the boys. Idiyon yung kami, bro. We didn't know that you guys stopped. Yeah, yeah, we stopped for a while. Doesn't it remind you of when we were like 20 years old, bro? Yeah, it took me back. It took me back seven years ago. Kitigil mo ba tayo? Tuloy, tuloy, tuloy na to. Ayo. Yeah, we can stop, bro. Somewhere sa Enlex, siguro. Quick little update, it is currently uh, 5.24 uh, We're here at T-Plex no? Kompleto pa rin naman yung convoy aside from sila Tony Si Enrique uh, with the AW11 Medyo inantok daw siya ng onte so we have to take a stop over here Bili lang ako pagkain As for us, we're gonna get a little bit of Jollibee So we got our Jolly Hot Dogs here Why hindi pa ganda pang So we got our food but yeah I can't get over this This sunrise, look at how beautiful that is You're never up in the morning I mean how often is it na nasa highway ka naman ng gantong kaaga Some of the boys are there, medyo nagpapahinga sila Ayun no 5.35 AM Boys are still here Ayun no, si Enrique nagka problem yata siya So he's inside the car sorting out whatever problem or he might have gotten food I'm not sure but here Here's the crew at the moment, na wala na si Moses, so nagkaroon tayo ng SIR dito, which is Joe, because he's heading back to Manila. Mas mabilis, alam mo? Hindi nakakaantok, yung uh -oh. full time. Yeah, <laughs> and then, alam mo when I drove alone going to you, inantok ako bro ah. Mas nadramdaman ko yung ngayon kesa sa papunta. Siyempre pagod na rin tayo, pero masaya pa rin, masaya pa rin, kaya kaya. Medyo may pressure yung papunta natin. <laughs> may pressure? May, may sumusundot na Enzo <laughs> Alam mo ba na ngayon lang natin ito ginawa? I was showing Calvin our old pictures. Ngayon, lagay ko na lang dito yung Accord, yung Miata, yung Accord, yung E46, the uh, SIR, the Miata. Ngayon lang natin ginawa ito ulit bro and I'm very happy. Tingin mo kailan ulit mo ulit ito bro? It's up to you guys because I do this. <laughs> Tingin ko pag may natapos na ako time. na other car. Oh. Someone's gonna say in the group, like, Wait tara, tapos na yung auto ko. Tingin ko kailan. Wala nang leak. <laughs> This legit feels like when we were eating Jollibee in Tugiganal after getting the Accord. That radiator yung pinatanso namin, whatever that means, sa Tugiganal. Up to make the top of the radiator copper and to make it more sturdier, more durable. Two weeks after, bumigay rin siya sa Manila and I had to buy a new radiator for 3,000 pesos, guys. But hey, thank you kasi at least naka-uwi kami. I'm still really appreciative of that. Boys, it's been quite an adventure. This is it, this is it. Bro. Bro. <laughs> Next road trip. Dave, safe, yeah, huh? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, bro. Thank you, thank you. Manila! Time check, 6.05. We're very blessed to have been able to do something like this, no?
guys we are back in sunny manila oh my god i that whole trip felt like a dream but the drive home in this sun was absolutely terrible na abuto na kami ng traffic and it was not the greatest experience but to anyone who's ever wanted to drive like this with their friends my advice to you is to just do it and make sure that your car is in the best condition that it can possibly be and there's no reason for you not to be able to get to where you want to be this trip was something that i've subconsciously been planning in my mind since i was a small boy and like i always say enjoy your vehicles the way they were always meant to be driven I really appreciate all the support that you guys have given me. I know that this type of content is really not, is not for everyone because not everyone appreciates adventures like this where it has something to do with the project or that you finished or you built or it's just something that's fulfilling to see something that you built and, and worked on and something you were passionate about come to life. And maybe next time, kaya natin tong ulitin with more people and maybe I'll get to bring my Mustang. Who knows? Sana. Sana. Drive safe, everyone. See you guys next time. I've forgotten you, you.